Hi everyone and welcome back to my YouTube. It's been a while. Today I am on my own because my training partner is unfortunately in hospital. So we are going to be filming a upper session today which is pull focused. So we'll go through that but I will just do a little update on whereabouts I am now. So for those of you that don't know, I am a bikini athlete and the ultimate goal is to get my pro card. Um, so we're just working our way towards that goal now. Um, last year I did do um, a few shows. So I did the two bros uh, regional where I placed first. I did the Alicante Europa Pro where I played four and then my last YouTube video was just before I was going to go to Romania where I actually placed third. So I didn't achieve my pro card last year, I wasn't quite ready but hopefully after a very productive off season I'll be ready this year. Um, I think it's been my most productive off season yet, even though we was in lockdown which is very unfortunate. I was quite lucky that I had some kit and I have a very good friend that has a lot of kit as well. So I was quite fortunate that I could still train and um, still get all my sessions in. Not quite the same as being at Ultraflex, but it was definitely beneficial. Um, I changed up my training split to really focus on my weaknesses and work towards my goals of being a bikini athlete. So I think that's helped massively. Um, and then now I have started my prep ready for the season this year. And I am four weeks in and I'm six pounds down. <laughs> in the session that we're going to do today, it's upper and it is full focused. So my training split differs from last year, how last year I was on push, pull with the glutes top up, rest, lower, rest. Whereas now I'm on upper, on two rotations, so one rotation is pull focused, or the second rotation is push focused. Then I have glutes and hamstrings, then rest, then lower, which is mainly glutes and hamstrings. So I don't have any leg extension, so no isolation exercises on the quads at all to make sure that my hamstrings and glutes bring up compared to my quads, which was quite dominant last year. So hopefully I'll have a more balanced physique this year. And I don't do any biceps or triceps neither. So um, that's how my training differs this year compared to last year. And hopefully everything's moved in the right direction physique wise for uh, the goal this year. Look what Arnie did, he attacked it. <laughs>
athlete for Insight Supplements. Uh, they sponsored me and Nathan after my competitive season last year and they are supporting us both through our prep this year and they're amazing. So use code GOODSTYLE and you'll get 10% off. Um, we actually worked at a Fitex show at the weekend as well and that was sponsored by Insight. So the overall winner um, gained a year sponsorship with Insight Sub, which was incredible as well. So yeah, Insight Sub.
started gauging my weights again um, just to make sure that I'm fully recovered from the deload and I'm nice and fresh and I've not got my old logbook so I don't know what weights I did anyway so we're starting from scratch shoulders rounded and you want your elbow pad to go just below the shoulders and um, but keeping your shoulders rounded to make sure you're using your lats and not your trap and um, but when I do this I have to really think about it because my my right trap is quite dominant and it's quite tight so it wants to kind of take over but I have to try not to overthink or it will do it anyway so it's quite a difficult exercise but I think I've got the hang of it now
the video, I am now an affiliated posing coach under Emma Heidman, the posing pro brand. So I am now doing one-to-one -one posing sessions out of Leeds, Bradford, Birmingham or Skype for anyone that's wanted posing. It was originally just um, kind of the PCA, kind of bikini tone figure, athletic figure, IFBB bikini style posing. But now I've widened my knowledge and I'm doing all federations in all classes for posing as well. My share plans for this season is firstly the regional, um, which is Rose on the 5th of September. Then my main show is hopefully going to be the Arnold's because that would be the dream to turn pro at the Arnold's so I've got to manifest. Um, and then I'm going to go on to do the show in Romania, I think, potentially maybe Denmark before and then maybe Alicante to finish my competitive season. Yes. Um, so that's my show plan. Things may change, it depends on uh, the outcome on the first few shows but that's the plan in the diary at the minute so um, yeah that's everything thank you so much for watching please like subscribe to my channel and if there's anything that you want me to cover next time please pop it in the comments and I'll make sure I cover it in my later videos thank you